Our team is spread out across the viewing area for the next four hours. We will be your eyes and ears. This half hour, Josh Short is in Frankfurt. Chris Spadaccini is in Lexington. And we begin in Lexington. Road crews out all night doing what they can to stop ice from coating over. Lexington with about a quarter inch of ice. And let's go live to Krista Spadaccini. Good morning, Manny and Paul. Yeah, we're here in Lexington and where I'm standing, it's currently freezing raining again this morning. It just started maybe 15 minutes ago, but earlier than that, Gabe and I were driving carefully around the city, trying to see if there were any down limbs like you found on Cooper Avenue. And we found here in a neighborhood in Lexington, just one, just one branch about this big. It's really not looking too bad. And emergency services, when I talked to them earlier, they said that Lexington dodged the worst of it. Yeah. Yeah, that's what the emergency management said. They're saying that it wasn't that bad. I want you to take a look at this video that I have from 5 p.m. yesterday. Remember all that rain that we saw? Well, emergency management says the city listened to warnings and stayed off the roads because now, as you're seeing this video from 3 a.m. today, and despite looking at that layer of ice on side streets and sidewalks, yeah, it's pretty thick ice. Officials say there were no significant accidents. Lexington police say there was only one non-injury collision since 9 p.m. Thursday. Now, salt crews are working on the roads, and currently there are no major road closures or passability issues. All main state roads, uh, New Circle Road and Manowar are clear and working. And later this morning around 8 a.m. Officials will be meeting to see if they need to close or keep open the emergency management center. The rest of the morning, we will keep you updated on the road conditions here in Lexington. For now, though, live in Lexington, Chris Spadaccini, Fox 56 News.